Once upon a time, there was a hard-working woodcutter who lived in a small village by the forest. He earned his living by chopping wood and selling it in the market. One day, while cutting trees near a riverbank, his axe slipped from his hands and fell into the deep waters of the river. The woodcutter was devastated as the axe was his only tool for work, and he couldn't afford to buy another one. Feeling hopeless, the woodcutter sat by the river, holding his head in his hands. Suddenly, the water shimmered, and a beautiful spirit of the river appeared. The spirit asked the woodcutter why he was so upset. The woodcutter explained his misfortune, saying that his axe had fallen into the river, and without it, he would not be able to continue his work to provide for his family. The river spirit, moved by the woodcutter's honesty and sorrow, decided to help him. She dove into the water and soon emerged holding a golden axe. Is this your axe? she asked, showing the woodcutter the gleaming tool. The woodcutter, although tempted by the valuable object, shook his head and replied, No, that is not my axe. Mine was made of simple iron. The spirit nodded and disappeared once again beneath the surface of the water. A few moments later, she reappeared, holding a silver axe. Is this your axe? she asked again. The woodcutter looked at the silver axe and, though it was more valuable than his own, he remained truthful. No, that is not my axe either, he said, standing by his integrity and honesty. Impressed by the woodcutter's truthfulness, the river spirit dove into the water once more. This time, she returned with the woodcutter's simple iron axe. Is this your axe? she asked. The woodcutter's face lit up with relief and gratitude. Yes, that is my axe, he exclaimed joyfully. He thanked the river spirit for her help and was ready to leave with his tool. The river spirit, however, was so impressed by the woodcutter's honesty that she rewarded him for his good character. Because you have been honest, I will give you all three axes, the golden, the silver, and your iron axe, she said. The woodcutter was overwhelmed with gratitude. He had come to the river feeling defeated and was now leaving with far more than he had ever expected. The woodcutter returned to his village with the three axes and told his friends and family about his encounter with the river spirit. Word of his good fortune spread quickly, and soon everyone in the village was talking about the miraculous event. Many admired the woodcutter's honesty and saw him as a role model for the values of integrity and truthfulness. However, not everyone in the village was inspired by the woodcutter's honesty. One of his neighbors, a greedy and dishonest man, decided to try his luck at the river. He took his axe and went to the same spot where the woodcutter had lost his. Pretending to work, he deliberately dropped his axe into the water and sat by the river, hoping the spirit would appear. As expected, the river spirit appeared and asked the greedy man why he was upset. He told her that his axe had fallen into the river, hoping to gain a golden or silver axe just as the woodcutter had. The spirit, unaware of his dishonest intentions, dove into the water and returned with a golden axe. Is this your axe? she asked. The greedy man, without hesitation, said, yes, that's mine. The river spirit frowned, knowing that the man was lying. She disappeared into the water and returned with his old iron axe. This is your axe, she said, handing it back to him. Because you tried to deceive me, you will receive no reward. Ashamed and disappointed, the man returned to the village with only his old axe, learning the hard way that dishonesty brings no rewards. When the villagers heard about the neighbor's failed attempt to trick the river spirit, they realized the importance of honesty and integrity. The greedy man's story served as a reminder that true rewards come from being truthful and that dishonesty only leads to disappointment and shame. The woodcutter's story became a lasting lesson in the village for generations to come. From that day on, the woodcutter continued to live an honest and hardworking life. He used his iron axe to chop wood, while the golden and silver axes remained as symbols of the reward for his truthfulness. 
His story was passed down from parents to children, reminding everyone that honesty is always the best policy, even when temptation is strong. The tale of the woodcutter and the golden axe spread far beyond his village. Travelers who passed through heard the story and shared it in distant lands. Soon, the story became well known across the region, teaching people the importance of honesty in their dealings with others. The woodcutter, although an ordinary man, became a symbol of integrity and righteousness. In addition to the lessons of honesty, the story also highlighted the importance of humility. The woodcutter never expected to be rewarded for his truthfulness, he simply did what he believed was right. His humility made his reward all the more deserved, and it showed others that true virtue lies in doing the right thing without expecting anything in return. Over time, the woodcutter's life became an example for others to follow. His simple, honest way of living brought him not only material wealth in the form of the golden and silver axes but also the respect and admiration of his community. He proved that it is possible to be successful in life without compromising one's values or integrity. The river spirit, too, played an important role in the story. As a guardian of nature, she represented the idea that the natural world rewards those who live in harmony with its principles. The woodcutter's honesty and respect for his environment were key to receiving the spirit's favor, while the greedy man's attempt to manipulate nature resulted in failure. The story also serves as a reminder that wealth obtained through dishonest means never lasts. While the woodcutter gained lasting rewards through his honesty, the greedy man was left with nothing but shame. This contrast between the two characters emphasizes that the true measure of wealth is not found in material possessions but in one's character and actions. Even today, the story of the woodcutter and the golden axe continues to resonate with people of all ages. Its timeless message about the value of honesty and integrity applies to all aspects of life, whether in personal relationships, business dealings, or everyday decisions. The woodcutter's experience teaches us that staying true to our values will always lead to greater rewards in the long run. In conclusion, the story of the woodcutter and the golden axe is a powerful reminder of the importance of truthfulness, humility, and respect for others. The woodcutter's honest actions not only brought him material rewards but also earned him the respect and admiration of his community. His story will continue to inspire generations to come, encouraging people to live with integrity. The lessons learned from the woodcutter's story remind us that honesty is a timeless value that transcends cultures and generations. Whether facing small temptations or significant moral dilemmas, staying true to our principles will always lead to better outcomes. The woodcutter's simple yet profound actions offer a valuable guide for navigating life with integrity.